Late last year, our News 4 Tucson investigators told you about an annoying problem that was about to get worse. Well, now it's a lot worse. News 4 Tucson investigator Nick Vinzant has more on why if you live in the 520, you're about to get a lot more robocalls. The numbers are staggering. 17 million calls in the last month alone. According to the Your Mail Robocall Index, that's an average of 12 calls for every Tucson resident, with nearly half of them being scams. It does get pretty annoying. I just hit end a lot. What's behind the recent rise? Tax season. Officials say scammers are trying to trick you into giving them money or personal information, even pretending to be from the IRS or law enforcement. Telemarketers can be terribly persuasive, and their goal is to separate you from your money. Most important thing is, is whatever they're asking you for, don't give it to them. Don't ever give anybody your social security number or banking account information, especially over the phone. So how can you protect yourself? T-Mobile just launched a caller verified program that screens calls for you. Apps like RoboKiller and the Jolly Roger telephone company block calls and even use robots of their own to annoy robocallers. So sorry, I was just staring at this candle and I missed that part. So can you say that again? And of course, the simplest way, just hang up. Uh, I just feel like the purpose is like not getting to the people anymore. Like you're just wasting your time using the robots. According to data company TNS, most of the calls come from the Kansas City area, which is area code 816. Tuesday is the worst day for robocalls. Sunday is going to be the slowest day. And if you have a story you'd like us to investigate, email us at investigators at kvoa.com or call 520-955-4444. For News 4 Tucson, I'm Nick Vinzant.